What's up YouTube? This is Andy from Digitech Dad, live from Melbourne. Today, uh, I thought I should give you guys a quick review of the Apple Pencil. I got this Apple Pencil recently, uh, and the, the reason I actually decided to use the Apple Pencil, not because that I'm an, an artist, I can draw, but they're not, good, not that good, but I use notes uh, uh, with my iPad Pro. So I, I write down a lot of notes, and I just, I was skeptical at the start to see whether the Apple Pencil is as good as other stylus. So I actually ended up buying it and I have a few uh, apps uh, for the Apple Pencil uh, or for note taking, which I think that you should consider if you use uh, your iPad to write notes and how uh, the Apple Pencil coupled with the, the note taking app can actually help you reduce the amount of paper that you use, save a lot of, uh, save the environment, but also you can actually use it on a regular basis if you do a lot of note taking, especially for you guys who are university college uh, students and also for, for high school students. So the two apps that I'm gonna show you today is one is called Notability and the other one is called Note Shell. So at the moment I'm using the Switch Easy Cover Buddy iPad case with an Apple Pencil holder. If you haven't checked that video, uh, please uh, uh, check that video out. For the purpose of this video, we're gonna be reviewing the two apps with the Apple Pencil. So I'll get the Apple Pencil out. This one is called uh, Notability. I hope you can actually see that. That is the Notability, and the other one is called Note Shelf. So two apps. I have other apps, if you want me to review them, leave a comment if you want me to do a review of these two other apps or all these other apps. But for the purpose of this video, I'm just going to give you a quick rundown of the comparison between Note Shelf and Notability. So we'll start with Notability. We'll create a new, we're just going to clear that. So what we'll do is we'll open up the two apps. One is the Notability. Just gonna clear that and then the other the app we're gonna open is the note shelf thanks so we'll just put down YouTube Apple pencil test All right, so we have the two apps together. We just put down. YouTube, Apple, Pencil, Test. Okay, we're just gonna get rid of that because we're not here for the typing, but for the drawing. So I have the two apps open. So we'll start with the Notability. So first of all, Notability has all the kind of uh, instruction or option at the top. You have the text, the drawing, the highlighter, the uh, eraser, your kind of uh, cutting tool. And this is where you actually lock the screen so you won't be able to write. You have the option for the microphone and then settings is there. You can actually add a photo or take a photo, whatever, figure, web clips and stickies. And then this is where you can actually review your notes. So we'll just do, we'll just try with a quick uh, sentence. So this is a apple pencil test so the feel of this apple pencil with this app is really really awesome i like the how sensitive it is how smooth the writing it is and there's no lag whatsoever in my personal opinion so there is no lag so it's really easy i feel seriously writing uh, using a pen or a pencil, if you want to call it pencil, 
but I feel like I'm actually using a pen to write on the iPad Pro. And uh, one reason why I like this uh, app compared to the note shelf is that you can actually review your uh, notes on the site. And then if you want to go to the second page, you just click that and then continue. This is the second page. And then if you want to, so it's automatically at a third page when you write on the second page and it actually goes all the way like that. If I go to the third page and start writing, third page, you can actually see here without me doing anything, there's already a, four, a fourth page open. So that's the beauty of it. And the good thing about this app is you can actually rearrange your page on the fly. So that's one of the beautiful, uh, awesome uh, feature about the Notability app. And if I go to the second app, which is the Note Shelf, the same thing again. We'll just start with the first page. This is a test for the Apple Pencil. So for some reason, I have a different kind of a feeling that the, the note shelf is probably the, the way uh, the, the writing is actually built. It feels like I'm sketching. That's my personal opinion. It feels like I'm sketching. But to be honest, I don't actually notice any significant lag on this uh, app either. In fact, it's quite as good as Notability. Uh, this app is quite good. But not as good as Notability. I find that the, this app is not as good as Notability, but yet again, sometimes I love using this app compared to the other. I don't know why. I, I just like the variation. And you can scroll uh, the, the, the page by using this kind of a uh, scrolling uh, option on the side. And if you want to go to the second page, this is the, the, the one thing that is different from this app for this app is that it doesn't actually give you an automatic second page when you write on the first page. So basically, you just have to click on the second page. And then if you look there, uh, let's say if I write on the second page, this is the second page. I think it does. It does give you the third page automatically, but I don't think you can actually rearrange the page from this view. So if I actually press a little bit harder here, I can't, I can't, I cannot re rearrange it. The only way you can rearrange is by pressing the button on the top here. You get a view of your page and then you just drag. I think you can drag like that. Yes, you can actually do that. You can drag like that not as smooth as the notability app and the palm rejection for the apple pencil is quite good so if i go back to the notability app if i put down my palm and start writing this is a test there's no smudge at all on the left side or on the right side of the screen no smudge noted so it's very good and if I go to the second app, it's the same thing again. I can just put my palm. This is a palm rejection test. No smudge on the side. You can actually see my writing is not as good on this app compared to the notability. There's a few kind of a sentence, uh, kind of alphabet that are missing. So I have to press a little bit harder to actually get the, the writing uh, properly. Whereas for the Notability, I just literally put the pencil down. This is a test. No pressure whatsoever in actually, in, and the pencil is actually able to write all the alphabets and the sentence that I want or the word that I want. 
So hands down, notability is much better for the Apple Pencil. The note shelf is good, but not as good. So that's my personal opinion. Uh, so there you go. Those are my review of the uh, note taking uh, app for the Apple Pencil. If you like this video, please uh, hit the like button. If you have any comments or questions, please leave it down uh, on the comment section below and subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that already. So until the next video, this is Andy Digitech Dad. Peace out.